What's going on, buddy? My name's Chris, and welcome back to Life is Strange. Uh, if you stopped watching the episode when I read the journal, I did come over here. I looked at this football. She mentioned that uh, there's there's no football free zones in this school, is there? How sad. And then there's also the squirrel that I lured over with a donut in this trash to take a picture of. So if you want to see me do that, then go do that. But I explained it to you, so do you really care? I mean, I pretty much explained exactly what you're going to see, so it doesn't really matter. But, yeah, so that's that's all you missed. Also, I'm very confused still. Why do these fences exist? Is there a point to these? Not really. Anyways, let's go speak to Max, Warren. It's over here. Get over here. Warren is, is out weird? and about already, too. Looks like he's waiting for somebody. It's me. Meow. He has a, Warren, why is there a box on shirt that's saying meow? Oh, nothing. Waiting for a call? I mean, I already took the call. Anyway, I wanted to rap about that action yesterday. Rap about it? What? Oh, that it's just a thank intense. you. Back in time. Everything happened so fast. Oh, okay, there we go. I owe you. Yeah. Oh, yes, you do. I got knocked on my ass by that dick. Oh, I'm so is already healing. Superhero. Weird. You're a real everyday hero. You stood up to a bully, and it was awesome. There's that phrase, everyday left hero. With said bully and ran off with that girl. She's pretty punk rock. How do you know her? That's best friends. Just a pirate. What? <laughs> Chloe Price. We haven't seen each other in a while. I bet you were glad to see her blast up in that truck like a rock star. Which begs the question, why is Nathan Prescott getting psycho on you? Meow box. I busted yeah. him in the bathroom yesterday with a gun. I'll give you the story later. <laughs> wow, what a Principal dick Wells move. Principal <laughs> is taking care of it now, I hope. I'm gonna tell You're you what happened. Weak, and, yeah. Like that bizarro snowfall yesterday? Speaking of dystopia, that drive-in is having a 70s Planet of the Apes marathon. Let's go ape! All right now, though, right? Yes, that's exactly what I need. I love those old-school ape films. Well, that was easier than I thought. Cool, I'll text you the info. Yay! Consequences, why? No, what? Warren is out and about already, too. Boot in a boot. Looks like he's waiting. I have to tell Brooke I'm going with you to the movies instead. <gasps> oh no! Brooke! Oh, Brooke! Why does they say no? So I should just do this. Max, check it out! Warren. Yeah, yeah, skip, skip, skip. Oh, nothing. Skip, 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 skip. Say thank you, let's see what happens. By the way, thank you for stepping in. You were pretty okay, bad so it doesn't really change one. anything. I owe you. That's probably the oh, better yes, thing to say, to be honest. You're a real every. Yeah, a real every hero. Me. Yeah, blah 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 blah. But I was uh, just a pirate. Just a pirate I used to know. I bet you were glad to see her blast up in that truck. Yeah. yeah. I busted him. All right, you're fine. Weak. Let's say no. Let's see what happens. No, I don't think I can concentrate on going out to the movies. I just feel like escaping. Fine. Be a damn dirty human. I'll go eat myself. Aww. Alright, we'll go to the dang movies. Max, it's over here. Yeah, get over Fine. here. Wow. I wonder if that. Oh, he kind of sounds like he's saying, um. By the way. Thank you. Early. Get oh, over here, yes, like, you, you know, like Arnold. I wonder if that was actually a reference You're or not. Real. Even though you left. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, at least I gotta choose all the answers I wanna go with, I like Chloe. I'm gonna tell about Chloe, I busted him. I wonder what happens if I say I don't get involved. Him. Whatever. <clears throat> Alright, we'll do yes, it. That's... Well, that was easy. Oh, sorry, Brooke. I mean, I have no interest in seeing this guy. I'm sure she's gonna hate me for life, but... You know, to take the bus? What? I thought this campus was all connected. Oh, that's right, I'm going to the diner, though. Right, right, duh, I'm an idiot. A stupid idiot. An idiot. I forgot to write down notes for the last episode. David talking to Nathan cannot be a good thing. This has something to do with Kate. Or Rachel. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Oh, it's this guy. Oh, I thought he was the bus driver. Like that guy, I thought he was the bus driver, but no, he's sitting just behind the bus driver. Completely obscuring him in a way that totally makes him look like the bus driver. Seriously, he looks like the bus driver. But 
the heck. Oh, here's more music for me and my video to get copyrighted on. Wonderful. Wonderful. If I keep talking loudly, maybe it won't happen. So, uh, how's the weather going for you guys? Is it randomly snowing in the middle of summer for you? It sure is here. <laughs> it's not really. It's winter. Oh, no. It's too loud. It's too loud. This is not going to work. Where's the diner? We need to get to the diner faster. Who is sitting behind me? I don't know. Is it you? It might be you, the viewer. Maybe that represents... <gasps> There's a lighthouse! Dang, that's actually farther away from Cadia Bay than I thought. Speed limit 30. Alright, this is the states. <laughs> Duh, I'm an idiot. I'm like, 30? Well, speed limits are 50, but that's kilometers per hour. Oh, oh no, don't fall asleep. Don't do it, it's a bad idea. Don't do it. What if Nathan's hiding underneath your seat? Ah, I got chitch! And he just, like, stabs me in the leg with one of his needles. What the heck do his needles do? It's a mystery. Blackwell County Transportation. Is that a thing? Is there, is there like actual charter buses at universities and such? Ooh, there's that important lighthouse again. Keep focusing on it. Right, hey, look everybody, look how far away this is from the rest of the town. Everyone's gonna end up there and they're all gonna get squished by the freaking lighthouse. Oh no, they're flying south. It is fall. They're in their V formation. Which means they're doing long distance traveling. Don't try to take it from me. It's mine. I wouldn't dream of it. I'm What's mine? a millionaire. Hope nobody steals my lottery. Talk about going back in time. The diner looks exactly the same. Woman. Hello, old guy. I bet he's seen a lot of changes to Arcadia Bay in his lifetime. No time for chit chat. I'm a millionaire. Yep. Got my lottery ticket right here. We are gonna lose. Bus so I can cash it in. You're not a millionaire. Steal it. Can we steal it? Dang it. it doesn't get. There's no steal option. She looks busy and stressed. There's no steal a million dollars option. Hi. You look lost. Close. Do you know if the bus has come yet? The online schedule isn't working. Oh no. I just got off. I just got off the school bus, but I'm sure the regular bus is coming too. Oh, that's a relief. <laughs> I can't be late for this job interview. Yeah, that's can't unfortunate. Can't we have to take a bus all the way to Newport just to find a second job? That is are also unfortunate. That bad here? Where are things good? I can't even afford <laughs> to live here. That is true. Well, Your job situation is pretty luck. bad everywhere right now. Thanks. I sure need it. Bloop, bloop. <gasps> Chloe. Running late. Grab a booth at the diner. Mom will feed you. Oh, she's running late. Okay, well, at least that makes me feel less like a whole person. When did... Was it like 7.40 when... 40 minutes. It's been an hour. Somebody better. I'll be lucky if you make it by noon. LOL. Where's the diner? Oh, it's over there. So let's see how far we can go this way. I don't want to go that way. Okay. Don't be a stupid idiot about it. Jeez. Can I cross the street? Ooh. Oh, there's definitely going to be something here. Save our city. Look at that. That's another thing that's popping up a hell of a lot. Let's, uh... What other photos can I take? Okay. Diner. Is it diner? Le diner. <laughs> Francais. French says. French fries. Dink, dink, dark. <laughs> RV. <gasps> this is also Chloe's RV. There's that dirty RV from the other day. Oh. Uh, stop that. Stop. No Barky. No Barky. Oh, is his name Barky? Really, I can't go. There was something creepy about that guy and his dog. Can I talk to him? I don't think so. Alright, well, could see it. look, there's that fence and then there's a bone. And the, there's a dog here, so that, I feel like that will be a thing in a little bit. So we'll probably be back here. Oh yeah, this one. The clean me. Obviously nobody took my advice. Nope. Can't go that way, okay. I'm sure this will have relevance in a bit. But right now it's ear elephant. What do we got here, eh? Look at all these flowers. Hey? 
It's so sad that nobody will read that. Saber B. In the man made drought in the bay. Store a life block, carry a bay, saber B. In the man. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. What did that say? Look something. He looks like a photo of the classic Arcadia Bay. Oh, it's a fisherman. Crusty fisherman. Okay. Good morning. Looks like you're ready to catch some serious fish. I wish, young gal. Arcadia Bay just isn't the same fishing town I grew up in. Are you sure about that? Oh. Has that was my only option for a second. Let's see my you later. Neptune's beard it has. Seems like a lifetime ago when I was king of the harbor. Neptune's beard, really? You did pretty good to have lasted this long. Oh, the fish used to jump onto my boat. Until the Prescotts and their finance fiends snapped up harbor mm. rights. The Prescotts have a lot of power. Yep. They might rename the town Prescott Bay. If that tells you much. Wow. That's horrible. Do you know them? Do good for my working kind. But I know them through their bad deeds. Let's not yep. get downcast. I hear the fish calling for Bali High. Never forget that old fishermen never die. We just smell that way. <laughs> I'd love to learn more, but like I have to get going. Happy fishing out there. It's not happy. Oh, you didn't say anything. Okay. It won't be happy. I hate everything. What was that if I try to cross the street? I don't want to go that way. Fine, then. There's a bicycle. I wonder if that, like, if they turn around and just go back and forth. Hey, that, that chip's on land. Huh, <laughs> cool. We heard the, uh, sign. Want a picture of it. Want a picture of it. Ha 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 That sign reminds me of so many times I ate here with Chloe and my family. When we were happy. Oh, you're happy now. Look at Kate. That's sadness. Two whale diner. Have a whale of a time. Blah, 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 blah. Uh, it's not going quite yet. There's more to this place than meets the eye. Hello, sir. <laughs> I love the way she awkwardly gets out of the way. What's the newspaper saying? I wonder if they explained that snow. Of course not, you silly munchkin. I wonder if they explained that snow. Oh, is that it? Read. Snow. Well, that's a good start to the story. Other service baffled by snow. In rare admission, the National Weather Service has yet to come up with a conclusive reasoning to unusual so far. Briefly hit Arcadia Bay. Oh, God, this week. Wow. That is wonderful. This one? Nope. Newspapers are going to be retro soon. Yeah, you're me. kind of already, to be honest. Sir? Can you believe this town? The world is on fire, and our big headline is snow. <laughs> I can hardly wait for next week's big story. <coughs> Clouds. I can't wait. The smell is odd. How long have you lived here? Long enough to know that Arcadia Bay will be a ghost town in a few years. I keep reading how Arcadia Bay is booming. The paper can only talk about that or about missing girls. Oh, yeah, that's kind of a big deal. You mean Rachel Amber? Well, I guess. I bet she ran away because she was bored. Who wouldn't be here? This guy's weird. I find him weird. Newspapers are going to be retro soon. All right. Hello, sir or ma'am. Weren't you the same guy that pushed me the first time? Probably. Huh. <laughs> Homeless. What does that say? I don't know. I can't read. Aha! Poor woman. Oh, I hope woman. it's a shelter for her. Well, that was a dude oh, guy. Oh, look at you. A fine a example yeah. of youth. I bet you're a senior student. I'm a freshman, yes, actually. Yes, I go to Blackwell Academy. I could tell you're a wise young woman. I know all about Blackwell and this town. What sage advice do you have for me, ma'am? I, I want to hear more about you him. I have dirt on the Prescott family. That whole family is dirty. They once done good things for Arcadia Bay. Those days are dead. Lack like anything in their way. I know somebody has been threatened by a press card. It's me! Then you be their guardian angel, because nothing gets in the way of that family. Oh, they haven't not. met me yet. Hell, they own your school, Blackwell. Almost. Almost? I don't. Who's Joy, you must Joyce, know Price Joyce Price again? Price from the two ah, diner. yeah, right. She's fed me more than my own family. How's a daughter your age who's always in trouble? Ah, I don't know who married that is. To ah. a real prick. Oh, I thought you were saying Chloe was married to a real prick. I was like, what? <laughs> she is. His name is David Madsen. He told me to get a job once. 
asshole. Not yeah, sure what pretty Joyce difficult. sees in him, but he better treat her right. Yeah, I'll kill you, How babe. long have you lived in Arcadia Bay? Forever. Seven years. <laughs> that I've was gone too far through from the cheese. same changes as the town. Hmm. Yes, let's see what happens. What happened to you? What didn't happen to me? Sometimes you start out in life turned around the wrong way. Mm. I married dumb, made mistakes, got cheated out of my savings, lost my home, and now sucks. I hang out here. I'm sorry. Have you ever lived outside of here? Where the hell would I go? I hate the sun and love the mist. I might be homeless, but Arcadia Bay is still my home. Hmm. I have to go now. Goodbye. Goodbye. I bet she's seen Arcadia Bay go through. Well, talk to me any old time you want. I'm trying to talk to you now. Okay, I'm sure the bone is here. I can take a picture of. Uh, I can definitely tell. This is some optional stuff. Milk. Oh, crap. The popo is after me. Can't read any of that. Yeah, photo. This fence is so broken. What the hell are you doing taking a picture of me? Why didn't that guy say anything? He is looking in my general direction too, so it's really weird. Oh, I saw the thing for the RV there. I'm not taking a picture of a bone though. So I'll take a quick look see. Uh huh. Fire walk with me. Oh, we do hear a wambulance going off right now. By wambulance, I mean a fire truck. Oh, what the? Oh my god, it scared me. I did not mean press that. Hello, how do you do? <laughs> what? Yes, we're open. Oh, there's two doors. Bacon and eggs, only five ninety five. Old fashioned service. All right. I've explored downtown. I guess I'm going to call an episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Enjoy the best way to support me is by leaving a like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I'm going to read the diary. Okay, my son having heard blah 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 blah. Of course, okay, as I told you, yeah, okay. Next page. <clears throat> I ran to Warren, or rather, Warren was waiting to run into me naturally. He wanted to know what the hell happened in the parking lot with the Chloe and Nathan show. <laughs> Once again, I felt like a dick because I should have gotten a hold of Warren to see if he was okay. If we just left him with a lot, I do it all Warren. <sighs> I only told him a little about what was going on with Nathan. The less he knows, the better for him. Probably true. Uh, I would love to at least tell him about my ability to fucking reverse time and space, but ironically, I don't think it's the right time or space. Because uh, besides, he would want to marry me immediately, so just so he just could have his own human time machine or capture me for scientific experiments, or make me go to the driving with him. Oh wait, I did say I would go to the driving with him. Hope he doesn't make a lame move on me. Not that I, not that, not that he would egomaniac. But Warren and I do have a lot in common, but he feels like a super cool geek brother. Anyway, I definitely need a movie escape. Before catching the bus out to meet Chloe, I saw Nathan talking to David. Dude, I saw. Oh, I saw. Yeah, Nathan talking to David. Did I? It's made me nervous. When did I see that? That's something I just kind of saw when I was looking at other things, so I missed it. Like how. Uh, what's her face? Uh, got hit with a toilet paper in the door, maybe. I had a nice soundtrack ride to the Two Whales Diner, chuckle going back in time. I haven't seen the diner in five years, but it looks exactly the same. Although now, there are way less fishermen and way more dumped food carts than when we were kids. Chloe and I had the best backdrop to play pirate old ships in a big ocean. Uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I will talk to you guys. What is this? Oh! How do I do that? Please press escape. Back? Okay. Yeah, thank you guys for watching. In the next one, go into the diner and meet with Chloe. And I'm sure this episode will ramp up a bit. So we're not going to end up at the train tracks with her. And she's going to get hit by a train probably and die. Bye. <laughs>